The next stage is after installing the application interface is since the installation of the enterprise server. I will start uh, with version uh, IP 2017. Navigating to the install folder and I'll start setup.bat. This is a new installation. I'll be installing in Siebel backslash SES folder and I will install the gateway this time English here we'll define uh, the ports for the application container that are um, listed in the example so for HTTPS I'll pick 9011 for HTTP connection port 9012 and for the shutdown port I'll pick 9013 and click next And I'll point to the um, key store that I created in the earlier step. And the trust store is using the same file. I'm typing the password for the entering the key store. For TLS redirection port. Uh, I'll type in yet another number. Let's say it would be 9015. And I'll save response file in the log files folder. As I mentioned before, uh, passwords are stored in clear text in these response files, so you have to be careful what you do with these files. And I'll click install. The installation process will take a while, so I'll pause recording uh, while this runs. Okay, a couple minutes passed, and I'm resuming recording after the installation. That has been successful. I will close uh, the installation wizard, and the one step remaining is to install a patch 18.8, and I'll start setup.bat. Uh, the wizard is open. Oh. Um, just click next here, looks good to me as far as the selections. I didn't have to enter anything, so I'll not be saving the response file. Pressing install. And once I see that the installation starts, I'll pause recording till it finishes. And I'm resuming after a few minutes. The installation of the patch is uh, successful. And I'm closing. And this finishes the installation of the gateway.